Hey, you lot, it's me, Stephen Carroll, the Northern Barrel. I'm back and I'm here. So, yeah, uh, as you know, I've, I've been quiet for a couple of weeks, been a bit low down and what have you down in the dumps. But uh, I'm here to tell them that everything is still good. All right. I know I did a few posts, a post a while back with a lot of negativity. But hey, we're all in lockdown, aren't we? So it's all a difficult time. And we're in lockdown, quarantine till possibly the end of May, beginning of June. But hey, we're all in this together. Stay home and stay safe. What else have we got to do? We've got to stay home and stay safe. And remember, every Thursday night at 8, we got on our doorsteps and we applaud the NHS. Because they are the real heroes throughout all this, aren't they? They're the real heroes and they're putting their lives on the line to save others. All them doctors and nurses, not just doctors and nurses, key workers as well. People that have to work because it's absolutely necessary. You know, we're all having a difficult time. A lot of shit's getting delayed or cancelled. But... We're all in this together, aren't we? This lockdown. So, I'm thinking, right, Paul McCartney, he said, right, that China needs to stop these wet meat markets. You know, because this is what's caused this coronavirus. China needs to stop selling. Well, I'm not saying they have to or they need to stop selling, but it's the way they prepare the stuff. You know, selling meat on the market unrefrigerated having parasites and bloody bacteria festering that's how this is all started so you know maybe china should try and you know get a bit stricter on the hygiene stuff because we have it strict here in uk maybe china needs to do that but you know damage is done now isn't it so all we can do is learn from them mistakes you know, I really hope China do take that into consideration, you know, with all that stuff, you know. But, yeah, what's been happening in this lockdown? Well, everyone's been keeping their spirits up. Italians have been singing out of the windows. The Spanish police have been dancing in the streets, keeping everyone entertained and the spirits up. Chat show hosts are doing live streaming on the bloody internet and everything. And what else is going on? Uh. Yeah, the water has cleaned up so much in Venice that the fish have returned and the dolphins. You know, dolphins. You know, them, like them, you know, dolphins, mammals. <coughs> That's the closest I can do to a dolphin. And, uh, you know, Godzilla. He's returned to the seas of Japan because they cleared up. You know, Nessie in Loch Ness. He's come back to the bloody lake. Seen as Noah's been polluting it with all their shit. What else? <coughs> yeah, Godzilla's returned to Japan. Um, and also, um, you know, Ness's return to Loch Ness. And I bet that I'm wondering how can all this corona crap be brought on by a bat? Well, see, the thing is with bats is they carry a lot of diseases and viruses. But they're immune to it. They have a strong immunity system than us. So they can handle all that crap, but we can't. That's why it's, you know, and it's like, obviously from that man in China eating a bat, the bacteria is bonded and mutated into this terrible coronavirus. It's like that bloody film, Contagion or Outbreak or what have they. Anyway, let's look at other positives around the world. So, people are singing in the windows, police are dancing in the streets. Um, you know, people are FaceTiming and ch telling each other that they love it. Do you know what? Go out and do that. I mean, don't go out and do that. I mean, do it via face chat or stream or hangout or whatever. Tell them, your loved one, that they love them. Yeah, yeah. What else? And I've already said the fish have returned to Venice, the swans and the dolphins have. I wonder if Ganges River's been cleaned up, is cleared up yet. <coughs> Sorry, voice is a bit dry. Uh, what else has been happening? 
Godzilla's return to see Japan. Nessie's return to Loch Ness. Uh, what else? Yeah. Even though this coronavirus crap is doing us damage and we're all having to stay at home and stay safe, sit on our asses watching telly, it's become kind of a blessing for Earth because Earth's getting clear. We're travelling less. You know, and the atmosphere is cleaning. So maybe, just maybe, we can learn to respect the environment a bit more from this. Right? Yeah. Because the Earth is a lovely planet and it keeps us alive. The Earth's better off without us, but we're not better off without the Earth. So think about that. But anyway, yeah. I'm uh, still keeping spirits up, staying positive. I know I had some problems a couple of weeks back, you know, but that's real life for they. But hey, like that a lot, especially you carolers. I'm in it for the long run, and I hope they are too. Yeah, sporting events have been cancelled for the first time since the war, but what can they do? At least we've got the Euro and the Olympics next year, so we might as well write this year off. But... In June this year, when we should have the Euro, I've been brainstorming on this idea, right? What if I did this thing called fantasy football? Oh, made-up matches. I'm still working on a name for it. Where I, Stephen Carroll, just pretend that there's a football match. Get countries to pretend to play together. But instead of scoring and goaling, people can vote in comments or whatever. Or on Random Ross's Instagram. And, you know, just vote, and then that could be like a win for each country, can't it? Yeah, you never know. I could be predicting future, I don't bloody know my sin, because sometimes I frighten myself when, some, when I say something and ironically it could happen. Not just me, but many other coincidences and what have they, like Simpsons and all that stuff. But yeah, I'm, all, I'm, I'm working on something like that to keep us entertained for the non-sporty summer this year. So yeah... That's what I've got going. You know, I'm in good spirits, in good elf, and I'm in good spirits, as I've just said. So you lot, stay home, stay safe, stay positive, keep calm, carry on, and applaud the NHS every Thursday night at 8pm, British Standard Time. All right, then, well, I've waffled on enough now, so I'll see thee later, Carolers. I'm staying here. Not really going anywhere. Yeah.